we have two bottles. Mm -hmm. Mix mm -hmm. with a dot and a water, so the rider has a choice. Okay. Energy gels. Mm -hmm. Energy bar from Belgium. And other energy bars so they can get their calories in a hurry on the bike. They burn off a lot of calories in a day and even with all the calories they put in their meals, they'll probably lose weight by the end of the stage. So they burn through. If normal people ate this way, they'd be on the biggest loser. But uh, for us here, a little bit different. They go through a lot. So it's uh, just to keep the carbohydrate stores up so they can be strong for the finish. So on a really hot day, how many bottles would they go through? On a really hot day, we'll get a lot of water. I mean, a team on a long stage might go through maybe 100 bottles. It, they have to stay hydrated. Maybe maybe two bottles an hour. Mm -hmm. So if it's really hot, a day like this cooler, maybe not so much, but they still have to stay pretty hydrated. And do some riders kind of have specific things they want in their musette? Uh, yeah, but when it's a feed zone like this, it's tough to separate. Um, they come through in a pack and to have a special bag, I mean, you have to be out with the bag. And if they come in a hurry, you can't swing a bag and say, oh, this is Levi's bag. So um, pretty much standard fare. Um, they, if some riders like more protein, they may put some protein, and if the rider doesn't want it, they just throw it away. They'll go through the bag, take what they want, and the team car can give them food. If they need something different, the team car can hand it to them.